last episode, we got a lot of crap done. And we beat the... Whatever it's called. The... King Mammoth, and got the Cola Bottle, and the King... and King's Fang, and the Basic Rock. Now, I'm going to show off what these things do. Let's go in here. Oh, we fight the Goo Tribe! A whole bunch of them. First things first. King's Fang doesn't do anything. This is what the Cola Bottle does. It's broken. And actually I'll have him show off the basic rock. This is what the basic rock does. Bang, bang, boom! But anyway... That's, that's what the stuff does. So now, I'm going to put Fishy back on Pogo because of that, yep. We're gonna leave them on him, and now go fight the final boss! Avoid them, avoid them, avoid them like the plague! Run away! Run away! Alright, good. Go up here. Make sure you've done everything that you want to do before this point, viewers, because this is the way that Bell is! You should probably save, too, because there's a boss up ahead. There we go! Perfect. Let's move on. Hmm. So she's their sacrifice. That makes sense. What are they sacrificing her to? Hmm? Well, they'll never, f we'll never find out because we're going to beat their asses. Look at us being all pro. <laughs> and the other guy's like, no, don't hurt me. He's ordering Zaki to attack us. We have a way around that. It's called Zadogarin. Wham! Ah, he has a lot more HP than he normally does. But we are uber strong. Wow, he's got a lot of HP. Hmm. Something doesn't seem right here, viewers. He should be dead by now. Oh, something happened. After you beat up on Zaki enough, something happens. You untie Bell. Why is it looking like the guy's a giant penis? I don't know. And we follow our deaths! And so does Gory. And they died. Or not. Saki wakes up the chief. And the chief runs away like a pansy.
I think he's dead. Uh oh. You know this music, viewers. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I suppose we're going to take him on on our own, since Zaki's not going to help us. Fight the giant T-Rex! Odeo! Oh, Zaki does help us! Sweet! Alright, now you're probably wondering, why is there a dinosaur in prehistoric times? Because he survived the meteor, or whatever, that caused the extinction of all the other dinosaurs, that's why. Alright! The dog ring. La la, his weakness. Fart techniques. And let's see. Bridein! This guy has like, I think, 600 HP, if I'm not mistaken. He's got a lot of HP. Boom! Fart techniques! Lala! And he's dead. We won. That's how broken Lala is. Defeated with the power of music, he runs away. Looks like a day broke. And that's it. That's this scenario. It's over. Look at that. There's grasslands everywhere. <laughs> but yeah, they come. And so do the other guys. <laughs> mm. And everyone laughs. And everyone's at peace. It's great. Because they dance on a giant meat thing, which is kind of kind of funny, actually. <laughs> Yeah, we killed off the last of the dinosaurs. That's how they actually died. The caveman with green hair killed off the last one. Look it up in history books. It's there. But anyway. We killed him because we were cavemen, and cavemen never lose. Except for that one time, but that one time doesn't count. Back in the cave. Take Belle back into our room. The monkey tries to get him, but we beat the crap out of him, of course. Silly gory. <laughs> nice try, gory. And the first spoken word. 
<laughs> Corey has to get the last laugh. And the end! That's the end of this chapter, viewers. I hope you enjoyed it. This is Parnash, signing off. Farewell.